in this video we are going to continue the previous video by starting loader trahedron go to the xy plane and using profile draw the pentagon after selecting the constraint standard give all the sides 100 mm and also angle between the two vertices 108 degree give to any three and go using point after deselecting the constraint standard select the arm corners and go to the workbench now using plane creation select the z zx plane and using x axis as plane reference give 206 as angle now go to the created plane and again draw the pentagon using constraint standard Finally, constrain the lowest part of the points of the pentagon to the points you already created. Already create any one of that. Go to opens. Now again create a point in all the three corners, main green corners. Same process will be for first plane, first pentagon, second pentagon. I'm going to create a, another plane by using three points. I can see the plane go to it looks a little confused but you can slow down the video or something else and you can see the fully full pentagon by noticing the points now we have the three vertigans, sketch 1, sketch 2, sketch 3. Now again creating plane by three points go to sketch and carefully again complete the pentagon again using constraint standard give the remaining two points in that edges Now go to our points. Now then complete the pentagon. Yes, as it is. Now oh, yeah. only going to draw the plane plane using three points. Go to the plane and complete the pentagon. Same process. Now just a two line using 180 degree angle and 100 under dimension. I think.
Now go to the wireframe and using the fill option we are going to complete the pentagon pieces one by one now again go to the part design next three points and go to the sketch when you create it uh, again complete the pentagon Same process continue. This is the last pin we are going to create in the opposite side of the pentagon shape. Create a last. Now complete the pentagon using rain command. Now you can see the gap between the two pentagons. Now we have the wireframe of the dodecta hedon in top. Now again same process. Using join command, select all the fields you created. Now go to the part design and using closer surface, select the joint and now hide any one of the fill and the joint. Now we have the part body design. Now Hide all the lines and the planes and sketches points you created. And you have the dodecta hydron. Now we are going to create the icosahedron. Now same pentagon but here now we have to join the, the center of the axis so make sure the pentagon doesn't constrain with vertical or horizontal Fully constrained now using the in command. 
and again using this go to the opposite line now you can see the 90 degree line now I'm going to constrain center point of the axis under the created line for the printer is in the center of the axis okay create four points in all sides of the pentagon using point command in z-axis create a point in 52 point 752 now using line command you can join now you can see the 100 mm length approximately complete that point to the pentagon plane your crater using plane create a plane in set y reference in 85.06 in negative direction I mean downwards now go to the plane and create a pentagon in opposite I mean upside down pentagon again okay. with same dimensions same the pentagon was must be center to the axis Join the line and the center of the axis point. Fully constrain the pentagon. Now create the point in three corners of the pentagon you create. What is the bench? Now again using the line command. Join the pentagon points. Join the zigzag lines on points you created. You can see the pentagon shape in every turn of the icosahedron wireframe. Point command create a point in point in the plane you created safety to mm in opposite direction okay. using line command create everything created a white frame of the ecosystem I think I missed a line here yeah, down side I missed a one vertices now it was the complete icosahedron 
to go to the wireframe and carefully fill the every every equilateral triangle faces you created and first filling the top and bottom of the pentagon planes Now fill the middle faces. Two left, three left. Now using join command, join all the fills you made. You can see every equilateral triangle faces created an icosahedron. 20 equilateral triangles go to workbench using closer surface select the joint and hide any one of the fill and hide the joint now hide every sketch point line plane you created get the part body edition of the icosa hydra thanks for watching friends we have completed the platonic solids subscribe to can gadget share with your friends thank you